Hey YouTube, how's it going? So this is my 2015-16 room tour for you guys I'm bringing to you in December. Unfortunately, my Canon Rebel T3 is not wanting to work correctly today. Uh, something's wrong with the aperture and the lighting's just not working well enough for it. So hopefully this will have to do for today. I know that this camera picks up a lot of light like right there. Uh, so please stick with me during this video because I promise you guys I do it today. And I told you guys that yesterday. So, again, I hope you guys enjoy this. All the links will be down in the description below of my furniture. Uh, so if you guys want to purchase it for yourself, we'll go look at it or the prices. You're welcome to do that. All right. All right, guys. So let's start here in the hallway. My door, I wanted to show you guys my pull-up bar, which I use. Uh, I try to use it every single day, but it doesn't always happen. Uh, to get just a little bit of workout in with that uh, pull-up bar there. And then when you walk into my bedroom, the first things you kind of see is like a hook. My bed and nightstand and just my wall in general. Uh, pretty much exactly what you see on the camera right now. Uh, on my hook, I've got my white t-shirt. Uh, which is actually a real nice t-shirt. But uh, it's definitely one of my favorites. So it's just kind of there. Normally I'll put like hoodies there or even my flannel t-shirts. Because it's becoming winter. Uh, even for California, it's becoming our kind of winter. Uh, I've also got a backpack that's actually one of my favorite backpacks by Targus. Uh, it's just a real nice material. And then that's actually McGregor's bandana from when he went to get groomed. And I've kept it because he looked really good in it. Uh, that's just their leash. And their, um, that's Ross's uh, uh, harness. I couldn't even think of the word for a second there. I've also got a calendar. Which on my calendar, I've got some things written down. You can't exactly see uh, too well. Unless I get a little bit closer. I've got all my karate stuff uh, written down. I've also got a couple of certificates here for getting my white belt. My master white, I'll be testing for yellow this month. Above my bed, I've got my snowboarding poster, surfing post poster, Eiffel Tower, uh, London, England, Big Ben poster. Uh, some wall shelves. Uh, over in that corner. Also, I've got uh, a couple different wall shelves over here, as well as a couple different posters. Uh, my favorite animal is sharks. I've had that shark poster since I was about 14 or 15, uh, and it's been in that frame ever since, so it never gets ruined. And uh, that's just one of my favorite posters ever, just because I do love sharks, along with my snowboarding poster, really. Um, of course, all these posters speak to me in a way. That's why they're in my room and hanging in my room. Um, I've got a couple calendars, some more hooks over on this end. Uh, obviously, I don't usually hang too many shirts except for the two end. Maybe even that one, a shirt could uh, hang there as well. And then I've got a couple hats. I've got my white belt, my master white, some lanyards, a couple shark tooth necklaces, and that wall shelf unit over there. But we'll get closer look at the wall shelf unit and I'll give you guys a closer look at my shark necklaces in a moment first we're going to come back over here and look at these wall shelves which uh, this one just has my sunglasses a couple cards and the hobbit book I've got my medication Advil etc in and Advil PM in that one as well as a let me get a little closer here sorry for the shakiness I'm on my bed I've got an LA Kings hockey puck Assassin's Creed Arno little figure there with a little bit of reflection because of the sun. My multivites vitamins. Pittsburgh penguin as well as the sharks puck is behind that one. And then I've got a Superman puck here. A charger. iPhone 6S box. And uh, three Xbox One games. Uh, Black Call of Duty Black Ops 3, Madden 2015, and Evolve. And you guys are hearing in the background my dog. Him, because McGregor tries to take his favorite toy, which is that moose. And unfortunately, they've been in a couple fights. This is McGregor. Go ahead and introduce you guys to them. His eye is messed up right now because they got in a pretty bad fight. Um, so... Yeah. Down below here, I've got a couple of bins. Uh, computer speakers, I actually want to get some new ones that are more wireless. 
as well as my dog toys my dog actually loves water bottles that's why those are in there he loves the noise of them so i let him have them now back to the wall shelf on this side is my xbox 360 games as well as three books that i am currently reading although i don't read all the time and i should definitely read more and then you guys see my walking dead and star wars poster which i'll be using both uh, for next year for meetings and karate and all kinds of stuff that i can write in them um, especially since there's not a lot of room and i don't keep up with my macbook pro calendar because i'm not always on my computer um, a lot of people have it on their phone and everything as well but uh, it's just not a system that works for me right now um, and now for you guys to see my shark tooth necklaces i've got this one which was brought back to me from hawaii I believe they're both brought back to me from Hawaii, actually. Uh, and this one was brought back to me from Hawaii. Um, and then I've got a vanilla cal can calendar. Wow. What do you go, Tristan? Vanilla candle, as well as a blue lava lamp, which I don't always turn on because it does heat up. Um, it does attract a lot of heat. I've got some PlayStation 2 and GameCube and a couple of Wii games uh, right there on that one. So getting to my bed and my nightstand, they're both uh, by Wayfair.com as well as my dresser behind me. I did get two nightstands, but the other one is in the spare bedroom because it definitely is a slick, nice looking nightstand that you can use for your guest room. Um, the bed is upholstered, it is very soft and nice and I used to always hit my head on the back of my wooden frame or my metal frame, I've had both, uh, or I'd hit my head on the wall. So I eventually found a nice, good priced bed that was upholstered. It's very soft. You guys can go ahead and feel if you like. Go ahead. That's right. That's right. Go ahead. You guys can feel. It is super soft. Uh, so I never have to worry about it. I also never have to worry about subbing my toe because this is also uh, quite soft. It's a little bit harder than the uh, frame up above there. Um, headboard. But uh, this side is definitely really soft. Uh, just the sides are a little bit harder and my dog's about to uh, unplug my laptop over there going back to my nightstand I've got a little air conditioning unit uh, Xbox one controller charging unit there um, I do have the Xbox one uh, edition that is white so unfortunately I was not able to find another white controller around me but that is fine I've got this camo one this is a Moshi alarm clock she does speak to you but she doesn't like to listen lately I think that she's just getting really old I've got some water by Arrowhead. This is my favorite water brand, especially for California, because I do love like Arrowhead and Wolverine Coaster. And if you guys want to take a look at my drawer here, you are welcome to. I've got some cookie crisps, which I was actually munching on last night, and I just threw them in my nightstand. Normally, I'll keep snacks uh, around in here just because of some blood sugar stuff, and I've just got some health uh, stuff going on. I've got some Tums in here, which is my life savior. I at night time, I prefer Pepto-Bismol, but Tums does work. Um, unfortunately, I cannot have the cherry one, so there's like a bunch of cherry on top. Uh, because I'm allergic to cherries, and the cherry flavor makes me feel very sick. And here, I've just got like, uh, let's pull a couple things out here. I've got my backs to those, uh, the original backs, but right now I'm using the charger backs. The backs that came with the batteries. Uh, this is actually a pocket knife that I keep on the side of my bed which actually usually moves around um, quite a bit but it's a pocket knife and I've got some quarters in here and I've got my uh, my old glasses in here my Prada ones that I normally wear every day that you guys usually see me in but uh, those are all scratched up and everything so I'm gonna try and get my new prescription on them and um, I've got some controllers in here uh, regular TV, dry TV, my air conditioning, Xbox controller, um, and a DVD controller. If this camera would focus, that would be great. And then I've got a little pot here. A little pot. That sounded so bad. A little glass container here. Excuse me, guys. That has uh, glasses cleaner here. I've also got an SD card back there. A couple pirate coins were actually for my karate. Uh, those give me like a... A couple percent off or something if I want to buy an extra uniform or whatever and I've got my keys and my wallet is sitting up against here like that 
And then right between here actually happens to be my glasses cases for the curtain glasses I'm wearing, which are uh, the Ray-Ban ones. But I got them for a pretty good price and a discount because the glasses place I go to, uh, a couple people there went to my karate uh, place. So they say the Red Dragon Karate family gets a discount. And then I've got one cookie is actually left in there, but I've got a cookie tin and also some Cheez-Its as a snack to keep in my room. And that's all that is currently under there. All right, so now let's check, take a look at this side of the wall. I'm going to go ahead and sit here for two seconds. There we go, let's focus. I've got a Walking Dead poster and a map poster because I eventually want to travel a giant whiteboard, which normally is more organized than it is right now, uh, but I haven't been able to fix it, and a pin board, which has my karate schedule and karate stuff, um, and uh, my uh, prescription, as well as a little note from Uncle Larry, uh, who's a youtuber as well. I put that up there. Uh, this is actually what I need to know when I test um, So I know I kept that so that way I know uh, What I need to know is what I'm trying to say so like uh, when I go to yellow belt in order to go to yellow belt I need to know five stances uh, No, all stance at one bag sets one through six five self defense moves Koga code of the dragon Tiago sets one through three and block set one so, I need to know all of that in order to get my yellow belt. Um, I've got my tripod sitting here right next to the door. It is just standing full size uh, right now. I've got a Wolverine bus bank on top of my dresser here. A Sades. This is by Sades, by the way. You guys can get them on Amazon. I'll put the link in the description below. They come in blue or red. You guys will see that in a moment or you already have. I've got my regular turtle beaches right there. And then I've got an Expo black marker. I keep that close by so I can write on my board all the time. Watches. And then this is just a, like a little drawer unit. Uh, which I've got a receipt in there and a business card in there. For my glasses place. And then this is the red one. Unfortunately these are completely imbalanced because the year thing is only on one side. Uh, that's the red sage. Um, and I do put the wire around that way that the... Uh, the connector piece is not hanging anywhere. I've got an English Bulldog whose head come up, comes off. This was a cookie jar, but uh, I didn't trust the cookies in there, so I threw them out. Because only God knows how long those cookies have been sitting in there. And I've also got my Cannon Rebel T3 uh, sitting on top of my dresser right now. This is my beautiful dresser. Again, as I said earlier uh, in the video, it is by Wayfair. And I will show you guys inside because I, they're clothes. Everybody wears clothes. Uh, and here's like my extra junk drawer. I've got my Xbox 360 Turtle Beaches, which those are technically um, one of my first pair, or my backup pair actually. I believe that I've made those my backup pair. I've also got like an Xbox 360 controller in here, and uh, my LEDs I've never put up, some PlayStation 2 controllers and a GameCube controller in my Wii controllers. Uh, back there so it's kind of like a game junk drawer and here is my underwear normally I've got boxers and briefs in here but clearly I've got to do some laundry um, and I've only got some boxers left and here are all my socks dresser socks and uh, I pretty much only wear white socks except for my dress socks which are black um, so other than that I just wear white socks every single day down in this drawer I've got some tanks, uh, white v-neck, PJ pants, and some plain black shirts. In here I've got some accessories, which is, this is my camera drawer. So normally my Rebel T3 would be down in here with everything else, but I tried to record with it. It's just not wanting to work properly. Um, so this is kind of my camera drawer, as well as I've got my USBs in there though. So I keep those in here as well. And then down on this bottom drawer, I've got all my shorts, sports shorts. Uh, there's only a couple pair of regular shorts I actually have in. The rest are cargo, which are a bit thicker, so they take up more room. And then down in this drawer are all my Blu-ray DVDs and DVDs. Um, so I've got a little bit of a collection going. I eventually will get more. And I've got a little Superman guy and just some little stuff right there. that Just little, little pieces of stuff.
So on this uh, door here, I've got another set of hooks, which has my Xbox 360 Turtle Beaches, which are all wired, which is actually quite annoying. I've got some pants that the button fell off, but they also don't fit me. I was going to put the button back on them and maybe give them up, as well as a bag that sometimes I use that one for karate in a messenger bag. And this is my closet. This is where most of my clothes are, except for the ones that you see in the drawers. I've got all my shirt hung up here in the closet, as well as my pants, which are hung up long ways to save more room. And then I've got uh, my dirty clothes in here, which I'm actually doing wash right now. Uh, I actually started a couple days ago and never finished it because my mind sometimes just doesn't remember that I've got something in the washer. And then I've got all my shoes right there. And then in here, I've got, this actually isn't supposed to be in here. This is my SD card, um, my memory card, I mean, for the cameras. I've got some Expo markers in there, a uh, flashlight and a lighter in there. My mount, wall mount box, uh, an extra keyboard for my Mac. Uh, I'm using gaming keyboard, a couple spirals that I use. My box for my Xbox 360 controller because I only bought it like maybe a week ago. Um, I like to try and keep the boxes because if something goes wrong and I need to return them, they don't have the boxes to be able to return them in, which will look more proper and more um, nice, pretty much. It just looks like you're responsible for that. Um, I got a wall shelf I've never put up. Also, this is actually a bench, which opens up. And I've got envelopes in there to send you guys some stuff, uh, except for the uh, Enatech, which is actually my computer case, which is a really nice case. And I've got a little dresser in here, which is only storage. Uh, some more books back there. That's a camera bag. Uh, my little shark vacuum. I've got like printer paper in here and pins and stuff. And then here I've got some nails and batteries and duct tape. My Wii and PlayStation 2 are back here. And then down here I've got all my filing stuff. So anything I need to file actually ends up down there or up there. And then I've got my two dress shoes uh, nicely put away in boxes so that way they don't get too dusty and then uh some flip-flops in that one and i've got like james bond monopoly uh you guys get to see a little safe up there the key is hidden though somewhere nobody knows where and then i've got a little weight thing for when i send things out to you guys i know how much it weighs over in this corner which is probably somebody's Probably most of your guys' favorite corner that this is going to be in my room. I've got a little calendar there, a mini fridge, uh, my deodorant, uh, hair styling gel, lotion, uh, sprays. And normally I wouldn't want to use my actual Old Spice spray anymore. I usually go for cologne for the age that I am at now. Um, the Old Spice spray isn't too bad though. Every once in a while it's nice just to be able to, especially if you're in a rush, then I don't know, sometimes it's just you just pick that one out. Uh, in here I've got a couple sprites, which technically I'm not supposed to be having any lemon or lime or any citrus or tomatoes. Uh, currently there's water there as well as a yogurt. And the reason for that is because I've got GERD and IBS, I've got some stomach issues. So that's what I am on medication for right now uh, for my prescription that you guys saw at the beginning. This is my beautiful desk. I'll put the link in the description to this desk. It is from Wayfair. It's technically a kitchen dining desk. But if you guys use your imagination, you guys can use it for anything. The reason why I'm using it as a desk, if you guys can't tell, it is much bigger than a regular desk. Um, which I really enjoy because there's so much more room, especially since I have to work from home. Uh, there are a couple of wires that are being shown. Um, it's very hard for me to hide all the wires in this room. But I'm definitely trying my best uh, to be able to uh, do that. Uh, so let's go down below here real quick. I've got one of my outlets right there. I try to at least keep all the wires uh, out of sight in a way. Because most people wouldn't be bidding down and looking under. And they're hidden behind the TV, uh, the TV wall mount. That is actually a wall mount that I've decided to put on the ground. Um... So I got an Xbox 360 charging pyramid, or not pyramid, uh, I used to have a charging pyramid, uh, you guys can buy those uh, as well, which hold up to four controllers, but uh, that's a charging dock for my Xbox 360 controllers, and then I've got my printer as well as my Xbox One edition. I've taken it out of the bottom one 
right there because it was getting too hot in that it's very actually cramped in there so it was overheating way too easily so i've taken it out and put it put it on top there i've just got some folders and stuff on the bottom too i use that for uh, my office stuff uh, and whatnot for storage i've got my direct tv xbox 360 i do have a blu-ray dvd player but that one is going to go into the living room because the xbox one is a blu-ray dvd player as well now and then i've got my verizon modem over there that unit is actually a cable box but i've got some stickies in there right now i'm using it for a little bit of storage again all you guys have to do is use your imagination a little bit you can only use, you can almost use everything for anything <laughs> So back to being on top of my desk, this is actually for my new monitor, which I got this monitor uh, yesterday, which already has some dust on it, uh, or I just didn't clean it off when I first got it. Uh, it is quite a large monitor, I think it's 21 point something. Um, it is by Samsung, I eventually want to have almost everything Samsung in my house. I do love this company a lot and I love their products. Uh, I'm not even gonna hate on their phones, I used to have a Samsung phone, but because I do have a MacBook Pro, I have leaned towards Apple products because I do love the MacBook Pro and I do love the iPhone as well. And they all link together and I do as well has, have an iPad. Um, but uh, Samsung is just a great company and I also love Apple company. I do also have an LG monitor, which is a great monitor as well. I got it on sale uh, a year or two ago. Um, so I've had that one for a while. I actually just got this one most recently on sale through, um, through Black Friday. Um, so that's when I got this one and then I, of course I've got a Samsung TV you guys are getting a little bit too much light there it seems um, my reflection is in the TE that's beautiful um, it just says area yeah, I've been disconnected from black ops 3 servers which constantly happens to me I don't know why it does that um, I've had some issues with that I actually fixed it I think it's just because maybe I've just been sitting on the home screen for too long of black ops three down here again on my desk i've got some cable organizing units plugs and a couple of paper trays right there i've got my playstation 4 black ops 3 which is your guys's giveaway actually i'll be giving that away uh after this and also i've got a polar bear notebook which is the coolest notebook in the world so i'm gonna try i'm gonna try and slip on this chair here and get a little bit closer to show you guys um so that's a polar bear notebook, uh, which is a really great notebook. I use little bookmarks for different kinds of sections. And I've got my work instructions and some papers down there. Tax stuff and all that great, beautiful stuff that nobody wants to do or deal with when you're an adult. Um, I've got my phone just sitting here on my desk. Uh, if you guys are wondering what this is, this is a gift receipt because I got a two-year warranty for this game. I gave away my Xbox One. Uh, game already um, so it come they both came with uh, they both came with two-year insurance I uh, gift receipts uh, so if you guys do want my giveaway please keep that because you're going to need that if you don't have a best buy then I can return it yourself I'll have you return the game to me and I will return it uh, just make sure you always keep that receipt if you have a best buy then you can do it yourself uh, so pretty much if anything happens, the game gets scratched, it spills, breaks, whatever, you should be able to return it. I don't know about breaks, but I'm pretty sure. Uh, just pretty much the general stuff that anything happens to the game, you guys will be able to return it. So I hope you guys really enjoyed this uh, room tour. I'm pretty sure I went through just about everything here in my room. If I miss something, you guys can let me know. Um, but... Uh, other than that, I am going to uh, see you guys uh, next time in my next video, and take care.